one of the things I love about windmills is that they're simple and they're true. There's something truthful about windmills in that, well, I can, I can feel them. I can touch them. I can take them apart. I can put them back together. I can work with my hands with them and actually hitting them with a hammer can sometimes make them better if they're dented or they need to be straightened out. Not everything in life works like that. So today I'd like to ask that we pray for truth. Not only for truth, but that we are protected from lies. Because even if something looks true, even if it's 99.9% .9 true, it's still 0.1% lie, and that makes the whole thing a lie. Almighty God, thank you for the many blessings you continue to pour out upon my family members and myself. As I worship and praise your mighty and powerful name, help me to overcome the lies of the enemy and seek truth. The devil continues with his conniving tactics to try to make me believe his lies. Sometimes the images I form in my mind are so believable that I tend to reflect on the negatives instead of what I know you, my God, have prepared for me. From this day forward, I will condemn the thoughts that the devil sends to penetrate my mind. I will confess that I will defeat the enemy. I pray just as you promised, Abba Father, that every weapon formed against me shall perish. The Holy Spirit will raise a standard against all strongholds. They will be cast down and destroyed. My declaration today, I have redemption over the lies of the enemy. In all things, I am an overcomer and more than a conqueror. I am the head and not the tail, above and not beneath. Therefore, the enemy will not bring harm to my loved ones or myself. You, King of glory, are my God, and because I glorify you, I boldly confess that I am a child of the Most High God, and I reject the lies of the enemy. The Lord makes me the head and not the tail, above and not beneath. God blesses me and surrounds me with favor as a shield. In Jesus' name, may I continue to be blessed forevermore. Amen and amen. Thank you for joining me up here today. God bless you. We'll see you tomorrow.